What up, Melvin7 here, and today EA have been transparent. They're actually showing us how chemistry works in Foot 17, and they're going to keep doing this throughout the year. So what a lot of people wanted to know at the end of FIFA 16 is actually being shown now. Now, I was hoping to be on the web app by now, but as I'm sure a lot of you will know, this error message comes up for a lot of people, but EA are working on a fix, so as soon as it's up, I'll bring you my packs and all that, and FIFA 17 videos will actually be back, not any of this bullshit, there'll be gameplay videos, new series, and I'll have another video explaining what's coming to my channel later on, but anyhow, this is just going to be a brief glimpse into chemistry, because they haven't released everything, and I can't really give examples, because FIFA 17 isn't out, so I'm, I don't have access to the game, I've only got access to this article, so I'm sorry, there's no graphics on the screen, and uh, yeah, I'm sure in time, I might be able to do a much better uh, video when more information is out, and when I've got access to the game, but anyhow, I'll briefly go through it, so... The article will be in the description if you want to check it out yourself and just go through it yourself and you don't have to listen to me, you can just click off the video, your choice. But anyhow, they are stating, like a lot of people found out at the end of FIFA 16, that this is for players at the start of the game. So they haven't said anything about informs, about wants to watch, team of the seasons, team of the years, what the chemistry is for those players. They will in due course, but this is for base players so the legends the um the gold cards like every card that is available from day one a day one card which i'm sure a lot of you will know they are known as now now the chemistry 25 percent of a player in your starting 11 will sorry 25 percent of their overall chemistry will be gained from the team and 75 percent of it will be their individual chemistry so what that means is say a player has uh five chemistry 75% of the overall chemistry mark will be that 5 chemistry, but also if your full team has 100 chem, then 25% of that will be incorporated into your player. So what that means, if you've got a player sitting on 2 or 3 chemistry, but your team's chemistry is 100, that might get boosted up to 3 or 4. It'll get a slight boost because of that. They haven't really said exactly what's going to happen um, in terms of how much a player get like they've got some calculations but they don't go through exactly how much attributes increase because of chemistry as you can see here they kind of go through it a little bit with them um, if the resulting number is greater than 50 players attributes start to improve towards the maximum of 99 if the resulting number is 50 the number is neutral and the player receives no changes from their base attributes if the resulting number is 49 or lower the players attributes are reduced towards their minimum of one they don't really go through anything other than that apart from the total calculation whether it's more than 50 then they'll get a slight increase on their base attributes and if it's less so on and so forth but it's still kind of confusing and as i say they'll they'll update this a hell of a lot more they've got some uh, equations here which i'm sure mathematicians who actually continued maths beyond gcse will understand a lot better than me but um yeah they're giving examples kind of like i did with the uh thing um sorry with my explanation just before they've also went on about substitutes but that that one's a little more confusing uh because i don't know what a static individual player chemistry of five like what that means is does that mean that the player they're replacing they'll get their chemistry or they'll just get five chemistry as a base and then 25% of that will be team chemistry and 75% will be the static player. They haven't really went through that too much so that's a, a little confusing. Um, also the table they gave for chemistry styles we can't access which is a bit annoying. Um, I don't know when they're going to actually update that but they have put an interesting uh, example. The sniper chemistry style will give 10 points to positioning, extra points that is, 10 points to volleys, 15 to finishing and penalties, but it will not boost shot power and long shots. So when it says shooting or defending or physical or whatever, it will update a lot of the stats to do with that, not just the base card stat, other in-game stats as well, which is nice to hear. Team management in-game, this is important, nothing uh, sorry, it has no effect. So if you, for example, put a striker left back in game, they'd still have the same chemistry as they did when you went into the game. 
So that is nice to see. So you could literally switch a left wing with a right wing and they'd have the same chemistry in game. As long as you started them as left wing and right wing with whatever chemistry they had. Um, and the final point that went through, stamina. This is very uh, eye-opening, I suppose. So as stamina decreases, other attributes also decrease. It's not just stamina, so acceleration, agility, jumping, strength, reactions, and marking. They will all go down the lower your stamina goes. So the longer into the game, your stats will decrease, which is realistic, because in real life, a player won't perform at their peak at minute 90 if they've been playing all the way from minute one which is also another reason why subs are very important in FIFA and uh, that's something I don't do a lot so maybe I will now because acceleration it just means they're going to be slower uh, obviously their strength they're not going to be able to win the ball as easily and other things so uh, yeah this is just literally a very brief outline of chemistry it's still so confusing but at least they're being transparent let me know what you think if you even understood 1% of what the fuck I've been talking about. Hopefully you have enjoyed. Subscribe if you haven't already. Like the video and yeah, peace.